Lindsay here. I am a teacher with VIP Kid, but if you teach online in any capacity, uh, kids love talking into a microphone. So I thought I'd post a quick tutorial on how to make a cheap, mm, little over a dollar for this one, um, microphone. Now, the supplies I use are supplies I have and I use for a ton of different things, so I didn't go out and buy anything specific. If you have to go out and buy all these supplies, then it's not worth it. You could buy a toy microphone. But this is stuff that if you've um, seen any of my other videos or I am going to make more, you'll see that I use these ma uh, materials all the time. So for me, it's pennies. Um, so keep that in mind. Invest in this stuff if you don't already have it, if you plan to make a bunch of your own props and reward systems. Okay, so here is my microphone. Okay, um, and so these are the materials that I use. Um, the basic plastic microphone was filled with bubbles. I got it from the dollar store right now at uh, Dollar Tree. Uh, they also have the other big plastic ones. I mean, any dollar store or whatever, I think you can find a cheap plastic uh, microphone. Okay. I'm not even sure if that's what this was supposed to be. Anyway, it was full of bubbles. Uh, I dumped the bubbles out, rinsed it out, dried it out. I hot glued the lid to the base so it wouldn't come off. Okay. So this was clear orange. So the first thing I use is sort of just a basic flat black spray paint. You can use the 99 cent can from Walmart, or you can use a little nicer uh, brand. Totally up to you. First thing I did was spray the whole thing black. Let it completely dry. The second thing I did was using some craft paint. I just picked a gray. I've got about a bajillion of these. So, but if you don't, 50 cents. I took some and I painted the top of the microphone in a gray color so that behind the glitter would be gray. Then I took some Elmer's glue and a paintbrush and I painted Elmer's glue all around the top of the microphone and just did the cheap old glitter all over and I put it in a cup. I didn't bring one, but I put it in just a drinking cup to keep it standing upright when I was letting it dry. Let it dry for a long time knocked off all the excess, rubbed it off. I didn't want it solid thick. Um, if you were to look up close at my microphone, uh, well, you can't really see. But there is glitter, but also the gray paint does show through. Um, I didn't want it to be thick. Um, anyway, so you shake off all the extra. I wiped it, I wiped it. Now, that's not enough because if you do that, then glitter will start to come off. Also, spray paint on plastic even though there is spray paint that says it adheres to plastic, if it's something that you're constantly using, I'm throwing mine in the drawer and whatever, then it is going to start to scratch. So the final thing I do on almost everything, unless it's foam, I don't, I don't spray foam, but anything that's hard, the last thing I do is I spray it with several coats of a clear finish spray. Um, I like the matte so that it's not shiny. I don't like that glare. Um, clear. It's just a protective coating. And so I sprayed probably three coats specifically on this part so that when I feel it now, it's almost smooth. Like it, it is got that chunky glitter on it, but I have such a nice solid layer of sealant on it that it's almost smooth and that glitter is not going anywhere. There is not little pieces of glitter falling off while I'm using this. I put it down, glitter doesn't hit the table. It's it's solid. And then I sprayed the rest of this a couple of times just to so that my hand and the knocking and the motion, I can scratch it. That's glitter. <laughs> That's a piece of glitter from, I think it got stuck on there from before. Um, anyways, this is pretty solid. This microphone is, this is gonna last me a long time for a dollar plus the pennies that of the materials. Again, I already have all of this. I use this all the time. So a couple of sprays of this from $4 cans of spray paint. I mean, cheap, cheap, cheap. If you plan to start making DIY stuff, I suggest investing in um, a black and white can of primer spray paint. 
a can of clear uh, sealant spray paint and some craft paints. Um, and in another video, I will start posting about different reward systems. And this is sort of the basic materials that I use for that too. So um, happy microphoning. I don't know. Kids love it. Kids love it. You love it. Come on, you know you love it. Okay, till next time. Bye-bye.